Tesla's health began to deteriorate rapidly after his 75th birthday, although he ate only cooked vegetables and kept visitors away from him. In 1937, he was hit by a cab but refused medical treatment. By 1942 he was largely immobile, and his mind was also failing. Although he was weakening physically, his mind found solutions to keep things interesting. His memory was filled with many memories of Mark Twain. Their friendship began when Twain heard that his humor had helped Tesla out of a serious illness in his youth. From then on, they developed a bond filled with many pleasant incidents. Tesla recalled every incident involving Mark Twain. While imagining Mark Twain in his room, Tesla went through the pile of memory records until he reached the satisfactory one. Then he concentrated so much vital energy on bringing it into the visualization center of his brain that it burned through and destroyed all subsequent memory records. The memory of Mark Twain's death was also wiped out. Tesla believed that Mark Twain was still alive, and in July sent a telegraph messenger boy to deliver $100 to Mark Twain at 35 South 5th Avenue, the address of his old laboratory. Tesla died peacefully in his sleep on the night of January 7, 1943, in room 3327 of the New Yorker Hotel. His body was found by the maid Alice Monaghan after she'd entered his room, ignoring that Do Not Disturb sign Tesla had placed on the door two days earlier. The medical examiner determined the cause of death was coronary thrombosis. Of course, things are never simple with Tesla so there have been claims that he was killed by a German spy, but considering his advanced age and poor health, it is more likely that he died of natural causes. Tesla's health began to deteriorate rapidly after his 75th birthday, although he ate only cooked vegetables and kept visitors away from him. Tesla's funeral took place on January 12, 1943, in front of over 2,000 people at the Cathedral of St. John the Divine in Manhattan, New York City. After the funeral, Tesla's body was taken to the Ferncliff Cemetery, where it was later cremated. The ashes were stored there until June 1957. The urn was transferred to Yugoslavia in 1957 and is now kept in the Nikola Tesla Museum in Belgrade. This museum also houses a large part of his entire legacy.